Hello there. Happy Wednesday. Welcome. My name is Kim DuPont. This is Orbit Jewelry. If you see that red live button, we are currently live. If you no longer see that button, you're watching the replay. Happy, happy Wednesday. All right. I am just going to get our Facebook page up and running here and get all the goodies pinned in. I hope you guys are having a great week so far. Make sure you say hello when you pop in. And let's get this good stuff pinned. There we go. And pin. Hello. Darlene, how are you? Thank you. Happy Wednesday. Yay. All right, I have like major spots. <laughs> you know me. Those glasses always dirty. I don't know. Is it me or do you guys have that issue? Because <laughs> all of a sudden, it, I don't really even realize it. And then one second, they're just, whew, they're bad. There we go. All better. <laughs> How was your week? Hello, Donna. Hey, hey. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. We have some goodies tonight. Um, 9.30. So we're going to go rolling into our opportunity and talk about paparazzi. Um, but until then, we got some goodies. You guys going to play for the bling bag, which we are up to eight pieces in the bling bag. Thank you, Donna. Um, we have our spread the love giveaway tonight. So anyone who has spread the love uh, publicly, I'll see those notifications. We'll get you entered. Hello, Kathleen. How are you? Welcome. You having a good day? Good day. Oh, good. Big news. Big news conference is on. Paparazzi 10 year anniversary conference in Las Vegas, uh, August 2nd is when it starts. I am so excited. So excited. My week has been awesome. Thank you. For those of you joining us via Facebook, uh, welcome. For those joining you, joining you, joining me via the app, welcome. <coughs> Excuse me. Alrighty. Edna, hello. Thank you so much. I'm doing awesome. I'm so excited. Are you excited about conference? Hello, Tanya. Uh, all the more reason uh, for me to <gasps> hopefully earn that Z necklace, walk that stage with the Kimberly. That's my goal. <laughs> Hello, Doreen. So I need all the help I can get. All the help. I think it's going to be an incredible conference. The fact that Paparazzi is celebrating 10 years, um, which is in amazing. They have grown so much. Uh, I think it's going to be incredible. So hotels already booked. Um, going to start looking at flights. I am so excited to attend that. So, so excited. I cannot wait. It will be my first conference. I was supposed to go last year, um, but it was canceled. And I was almost convinced that it was going to be virtual again. So when they made the big, big announcement yesterday, it was like, why? Everybody was going crazy. So, Gunda, hello. How are you? Hello, Michelle. Ladies having a good day, a good week so far? I hope so. Um, tonight we have, we're going to do uh, our regular uh, sale, right? <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> the allergies are just killing me. I don't know how you guys are doing. Hello, Carla. Um, and then we're going to go into somewhere around 930 because I had, that's what I had posted the event. We're going to go into the paparazzi opportunity. Um, so if you know anyone who is looking for a way to make some extra money, they have been researching different direct sales companies, um, please tag them and invite them to join us tonight. Um, but 
we're gonna jump into some jewelry. So first thing I'm gonna do, I forgot to pull this ring out. I just threw this one on. I'm gonna grab that ring real quick and we're gonna get this party started. Yay! I got all my, some wood pieces out and there we go. I have the ring, perfect. Um, wood pieces, I'm ready for summer. I don't know about you guys. Uh, we're gonna do the bling bag. There are eight pleat pieces that you guys are gonna play for. Everything you're gonna see is $5. It is all 100% nickel and lead free. Uh, if I have anybody here who is new to paparazzi accessories, let me know. Uh, the folks that I do see, <laughs> I know you guys know all about it. Uh, it's addicting. So if you are a new paparazzi accessories shopper, I will warn you, it is highly addictive. When you get that first piece, you're just amazed. Um, and the pieces just keep getting better and better. Last night I ordered Fashion Fix. So anyone who had pre-claimed any of the Fashion Fix pieces, Fashion Fix ordering last night was a success. I uh, was able to get everything that folks wanted. I did buy a few extra of some of the pieces, <laughs> I'll be honest. <laughs> So those hopefully will be uh, in soon. So the way this works, we use a program called Common Sold. If you are shopping from Facebook, you're gonna comment sold and the number just like you see it above my head. If you are shopping from the mobile app, you just have to click on the picture and add to cart. Easy peasy. Carla, I'm addicted for sure. <gasps> we all are. I, once you get that first piece, it's, it's it. It's in the blood, <laughs> right? Um, let's see. I do honor the buy 12, get the 13th piece for free. It is the only promotion that Paparazzi allows us to do as consultants. Um, and the way it works is when you have purchased 12 pieces, I then put a credit on your account for that free 13th piece. Hi, Jean. It is addicting, isn't it? It is. Um, but it's so, it's guilt free, right? Compared to all of the, and it's the same fashionable, trendy styles that you find in department stores, accessory shops for a fraction of the cost. And we know everything is nickel and lead free. You're right, Carla. You don't realize the quality and how pretty until you buy it. And some pieces are so much prettier in person. Thanks, Sean. I've been slacking. <gasps> so many, so many cute, cute things. All right, so we're gonna start with the pieces that I have on. Uh, the necklace, love this, I love the color. Hey, Mom, how are you? Um, so the conference is on. I will be heading to Las Vegas in August for the conference, hoping to walk that stage with a Z necklace around my neck. <gasps> Barbados Bopper. And they have the cutest names. Pink Wood, it's sitting on brown cording. Now this one has, let me see if I can slide it out of the card. This has a little bead and loop closure. Very lightweight. All of the necklaces, unless it is an urban, come with a pair of matching earrings. <laughs> she didn't. So, mom, uh, Sean, who's on the app, uh, she said, hi, bling mom, <laughs> LOL. Barbados Bopper sold 100, 100, uh, lightweight, layered, Amazing piece, one zero zero. Hello, Don Swenson. We're all having an awesome night. I hope you are too. One zero zero for my necklace. And again, if you're shopping on Facebook, you're just gonna comment sold and the number. If you are on the mobile app, you just click on the picture and add to cart. She's laughing. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sometimes the um, emojis don't show, but Well, she does have the app. She does have the app. It depends on, I guess, what device she's on. <laughs> but I think on her iPad. You have the app, right, Mom? <laughs> My niece got her all set up. Uh, my bracelet. Island Expression Stretchy. The wood, so the little wood discs, which, which kind of gives it that floral design. One zero one, one zero one, um, one oh one island expression. Thanks, Dawn. We are doing a sale until about five uh, five thirty. What the heck? <laughs> you want to hang out until five thirty in the morning? I think I'll have enough jewelry we could get through. Uh, 101, Island Expression. Um, we're going to do a sale until about 9.30, and then we're going to go over into uh, all about paparazzi and the use. I do. It's too easy to use. <laughs> so now she's forced to, to write sold. Oh, it's stormy there. Oh no! Boho Blossom. So this is the ring that I have on. Standard stretch. The fit size is 6 through 10 comfortably. And here's a little tip on the rings. Uh, when the stretchy piece comes all the way up to the top where that design is, you're going to have a little bit more flexibility. They'll run, I don't want to say they run larger, but they'll stretch. So if you have a larger finger or sometimes those days when we're a little bit more puffy, um, you you have more give on those as opposed to a piece. And I don't know if I have one like really quick and handy right in front of me. You know, when I want one, I don't have it. I don't. But when the solid metal comes down to the down the side of the finger, those will fit a little bit more snugly. Snugly. Is that a word? Boho Blossom 102. Isn't that a cute fun ring? 102. 102. Puffy. Yes. A puffy. It's a puffy day. It's a puffy day. Cynthia, how are you? My goodness, girl, it's been a while. How you been? How have you been? Here is a very dainty silver with the white, like pearl or shell like finish. Summer Shores sold 103. 103. Thank you, Cynthia. 103. That is so, so pretty. So I know the the light is going to kind of wash this out a little bit, but it, it has that mother of pearl um, finish to it. Very dainty chain. Your matching earrings. Summer Shores 103. More of a medium length. So we are live both on Facebook as well as our mobile app. So we've got folks on both. Those that are in the app can see comments from both the app and Facebook. Those that are on Facebook um, will not be able to see the uh, comments coming in from the app. So Edna says, hello, Cynthia. <laughs> Darlene, I feel puffy every day. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> Summer Shores sold 103103. 103. Oh, you're funny. You don't, you know, you all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh. 103. That is so pretty. So with that one, I was 
deciding what pieces I wanted to pair with that. I love that chain too. It's very dainty. So the earrings I paired with that are these longer teardrop shaped, just a very smooth silver. So it's really going to bring out the silver surrounding that white. The drop off is sold 104, 104. 104 in shiny a silver lightweight fish hook backing. Stretchy white moonstone. Textured silver beading. You have some larger smooth silver. Once upon a maritime. I'm not fat, I'm puffy. <laughs> That's right. We uh, are all there. And it's amazing, huh? How some days, like, you wake up and you're like, what happened to my fingers? They became sausages overnight. 105, 105. White Moonstone. We have this one in navy blue as well. 105. And this amazing cuff, this is just a gorgeous statement piece. It does not look or feel like a $5 piece of jewelry. Uh, this is a solid piece. There's no squeezing that. <laughs> Fluffy girl equals me. <laughs> Bronco bust. Oh, Cynthia, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. This is sold 106106. Gorgeous statement piece. That's terrible. All right. Is Dawn... She is here. Alrighty, we had a request for this one. So, uh, whoops, hold on, it didn't scan. Oh, this is not the one I wanted. Hold on, I looked at it and I said, oh, that's the one I want, but that's not the one I want. Give me a moment. in my onesie section. Hold on. Oh, no, here it is. I've got it. It was hiding on me with my silver bracelets. I'm going to show this one first. This is Summer Scandal Stretchy. 107. 107 Stretch Bracelet. This is the one that she wanted to see. When Yin Met Yang, another stretch. So this one has those sections in between that have a little bit more um, antiquing on them. Stretchy, sold 108, 108. 108, hey Cheryl, how are you? Maya, hello, hello. So we are doing our regular 8 p.m. Wednesday night live. And at 9.30, we're going to talk about paparazzi and the uh, paparazzi opportunity. Um, the conference, we received notification that the conference, the annual conference, which last year was canceled um, and made virtual, uh, this year it is on in Vegas, uh, so for most of you know that I am in the competition for a Z necklace. Uh, all the more reason I want to be on that stage. 
basic babe silver long necklace this one multi-chain at the bottom so you have your dual uh, chains your thin silver links this is a beautiful lightweight statement piece basic babe sold 109 109 one zero nine so we do have a mobile app available so for those of you that are on Facebook uh, if you're new to Orbit Jewelry you want to make sure that you register um, and there's a couple of different ways that you can shop with us there is the mobile app which is available on both the Apple Store as well as the Google Play Store it's free to download the links directly to either of those are in the comments section, or you can just go to the Apple Store or Google Play Store and search Orbit Jewelry, download our app. Uh, we're live in there all the time, as well as on Facebook. It's so easy to shop from. Uh, the video quality is a little bit clearer. The commenting comes through quicker, so claiming a piece is much easier as well. Um, or when you're shopping from Facebook, you just comment sold and the number like you see it above my head. As long as you're a registered shopper with Orbit, Orbit Jewelry, you'll see it going into your shopping cart. Our week runs Sunday to Sunday. So you can shop for the entire week. We charge a flat $4 shipping fee. Um, and as you can leave your car open for the week and that way you only charge the one shipping rate. You must be checked out prior to 5.30 p.m. Eastern on Sunday. Carts will empty out at 5.30. At 5.30. Oh, thank you, Cynthia. Um, so anything that may have sold out, it's on someone's wait list. If you don't check out, those pieces are automatically going to move over to the next person waiting in line for them. But the app is really a quick, fun way to shop. Keep it wheel. Keep it wheel. Green, we have these. So with this necklace and those bracelets, um, I pulled in three different. So three different colors, same exact earring. So we'll start with the green. 110, sold 110 for that light green, so you can just totally change this up. Different colors, 110. Uh, thank you. I am so, so excited. Um, I am just so honored to have been nominated to participate in the competition. And the competition is, is tough. There are over 300 of us vying for that piece or a piece I should say <laughs> keep it wheel in white sold 111 111 but I'm gonna give it my all I am gonna give it my all and hopefully And here it is in purple. So more of a lavender color on this. Sold 112. Sold 112. 112. They're cute. They're not too big, right? So it gives you a little bit of movement, a dangly type of earring that's not too, too big. I'm going to move these over here. Alrighty, here's a statement cuff in white. Sold 113. Now, this, um, it does run a little bit bigger, so the opening is a little wider, but it has flexibility where you can squeeze that down but that is a gorgeous all white cuff sold 113 113 i will tell him cynthia he's probably gonna pop on here i'm sure we'll see him pop on 
he usually will pop on, say hello. He'll pull the card for the bling basket. Sold 113 for the white. And like I said, that has some give. So you can squeeze that down and make it uh, fitted. 113. I paired that piece with this shorter white and silver. So these just remind me of the beach. Stones that you will pick up at the beach, that chunky chain. It has the matching earrings. Whoops, it didn't scan. Hold on, I keep switching to Facebook because I don't see the little, um, the pictures that Cynthia's popping in there on the app. <laughs> Grand Canyon Grotto. Uh, that is a fun summer pop of white. 114, 114. 114, and the earrings. This too, a little bit longer, teardrop shaped. These will be sold 115. 115 fish hook backing. Some antiquing in there. I'm sensing a pattern here. <laughs> Love the names. Fish hook backing silver is sold 116. 116. Look at the detail on this one, right? Kind of a fun. Um, so you have almost um, punched holes going down, and it almost looks like punched holes coming up. So you get that kind of uh, raised section. I'm sensing a pattern sold 116. 116. 116. Now with that, I paired it with turquoise and silver. Here is a newer piece. This just arrived yesterday. So we have this one in red, um, orange, gray, and now turquoise. I don't believe I have this one in black. That is sold 117, 117, long necklace. Even the necklace is longer. We'll have an extender. And if there's a lobster claw. Sold 117, 117. Turquoise. So that long one, or... And this one I know is limited. Two available on this one. A shorter, so you have that teardrop shaped turquoise stone. Oops, I have a, a ring twisted. There we go. That makes more sense. Now it's equal. <laughs> 118. You have your little ring earrings. Sold 118. One eighteen. Lobster claw and extender. This too. This is a solid piece. Riverview sold one nineteen. One nineteen. One nineteen. And I have a couple of different rings that I paired with these. 119 for that one. The first, did you all uh, work today? Cactus Cabana, 120, 120. Standard stretch. One, two, zero. 
So that is one. And the other is I'm still like bouncing off the walls for everything that's everything. That is such a New England everything. <gasps> Tumbling and Tumbleweeds 121. <gasps> that's a Michelle Kaler ring for sure. <gasps> 121, a Tumble and Tumbleweeds. Do you guys see what's happening? to my nail polish, I don't understand why I keep getting like this change of color. <laughs> I wonder if there's something like just is not agreeing with me. Never had an issue ever, ever. I don't know what's up. All right, a bunch of you had this on wait list so you should have seen it pop into your carts. What a wonderful world. Magnetic brown cording with the little silver bars. So these silver bars will slide on here. Not like super easily. You won't see them like just sliding away, but they will slide so you can center it on your wrist. 122 sold 122 oh good Edna oh thanks Karen I love pink actually sold 122 magnetic One twenty-two. So with this one, um, I chose a couple of different necklaces, some statement pieces, a longer. So the first is this very chunky necklace. So this is a piece you could kind of dress it up a little bit or uh, wear it very casually. That chunky chain. You have your brown, almost stone-like beading, which has a brush of silver on there. Looking glass glamorous. Looking glass glamorous. <laughs> Double chain on the side. One, two, three. One, two, three. So that is one. The other is... Now this is a blockbuster piece, right? So we know that this one, if it sells out, we can get more of this. Charmed, I'm sure. Brown. There's a lot of detail on this brace, on this bracelet, on this necklace. So chunky chain, you have the brown cording woven through lots of different charms on here. One of which with all my heart on one side and then Love the Lord your God with all your heart, Luke 10, 27. Chunky chain, even the earrings are really cute on this. I don't think it's mood polish though. That's what, um, and it seems to be fine when it's first done, right? Cause that's the, the tips. It almost looks like it could be, right? That color changing, um, because the tips are the pink which is the color that it was when I left the salon. Um, and it seemed to stay that way, but as the days go on, the, the color, like over my nail bed, I guess, it was what's changing color and I don't understand it. One, two, four. I mean, it doesn't look bad. Pink and orange look great together, so I'm okay with it. <gasps> One, two, four, one, two, four. And then I paired a, the longer piece. So this one has that dark brown faceted beads, multi-chained at the bottom. Margarita masquerades. One, two, five, thanks. One, two, five. 
for the brown and silver. So I kind of paired that bracelet with a few different things. I need to make sure I keep track of the time. <clears throat> So don't be afraid to tell me, Kim, we're getting close. <laughs> Alrighty, this necklace, I'm going to hold up to show you the different colors that we have. Um, so we have this in yellow, gold, and black. We have it in this red, a deeper red, and the yellow gold. And we also have it in silver and black. So I'll do the gold first, we'll do red, because that's what ended up in my right hand. Is the magnet strong, Sean? So I think, hold on, let me grab that piece. You got to give it a good tug to open it. Um, if you get it caught on things, it's probably going to pop off. I know I had customers, one customer got it caught on the door handle, popped off. It ended up falling into the car. Luckily, she didn't lose it. But the remember the one, um, I have another one. Hold on one second. The closure on it. So this one is a gray, and I really wish they would do all of the closures like this. So this one is magnetic, but it comes down, right? So that one, when you pull, it's kind of locking it in, in place. Um, so this one is almost guaranteed. I mean, I guess if you got it caught, somehow it pulled down. It would pull apart so this one is you're less likely to lose it than this one so this one you really would want to just be careful that you don't get it caught yeah Cheryl lost hers so this one here is sold 127 the gray with the rhinestones but I love this design I think this is brilliant you know, that easy magnetic closure, but it almost locks it into place. That is one, two, seven, one, two, seven. Um, just go make sure, make sure I didn't miss anything. Alrighty. So here's the yellow gold with the red. The pack leader sold 126, 126. So that shorter necklace. Tassel earrings with this one, 126. The yellow gold with black. Whoops, of course I just pick up the silver yellow gold with black will be one two eight wait a minute where did uh hold on the red one didn't scan Duh. Oh, it was 126. Oh, I had scanned it before the gray. So this one's 126. Sorry. I scanned it before the bracelet. <laughs> I was like, where is it? <laughs> the gold and black is 128. So gold and black, 128. Yeah, I do too. And I know, um, I'm trying to think, I think there was a black one like that, if I remember correctly, that we had uh, sold out of. And 
and here's the silver and black. 129, 129 for silver. 129. One twenty nine. With the yellow gold, I paired these earrings. Sold one three zero fish hook backing. One three zero. And this bracelet, fabulous hinged bracelet, shiny silver. Um, I no longer have this available. Shiny, I said shiny silver, it's shiny yellow gold. <laughs> I no longer have this available in silver. We did have it, it did sell out. Um, so we've got yellow gold, but look at how fabulous that is. 131, 131, and that is a hinged. 131, with the black and silver, I have another hinged bracelet. This one, smooth silver on the bottom, and then you have your black with the detail. One, three, two, one, three, two. So again, that oval shape, so that detail stays at the top. Unless you have these little itty bitty tiny wrists like Cheryl does. <laughs> One, three, two, but a medium size wrist, uh, that's going to, that's going to stay, right? No matter how you turn, that detail stays at the top just with that design of that oval. It is probably one of the most brilliant designs ever, ever, ever. orange double dainty chain triassic error 133 your little matching earrings the orange crackle stone this is so different i love it more of a medium length 133 133 And so the reason I chose, I went with orange and silver because look at this bracelet that arrived. How cute is this brown leather with the silver feather. This is a pull cord closure. Dark brown leather. Frond and center, one, three, four, one, three, four. So you have your multi strands, two that are braided, two that are the smooth brown leather, and then the one with the orange, one, three, four. And the more this is worn, the softer that leather will become. And would look fabulous with this one. I love this necklace. My, the orange cording texture, that hammered silver ring. This is 135, sold 135. 135. Just a fun, casual piece with orange and a couple of different ear oops I just got hooked on the the drawer handle festively floral so a longer earring with the orange bead fish hook and backing lightweight they are quite long 136 136 136 uh, or a little pop of some rhinestones in orange. Botanical butterfly, butterfly design in here. I have these earrings with the green rhinestones as well. 
if anyone would like to see those. 137, 137. 137. So there's some orange with the silver. Couple of the Now this bracelet, I have two uh, available. This bracelet has the lobster claw and extender. It's black cording with the silver beading, the silver bars. We aim to please 138, sold 138. 138. So, black, like I said, the black cording underneath. So you get some movement. Um, these beads and the bars are strung on that black cording. 138. Now I have a couple of, of the Fashion Fix pieces. So last night I went in and the Fashion Fix pieces that I actually had here, um, I put the quantity in. So some of you that ordered some of those, you saw those pop into you, your cart. Um, so the first person actually who claimed a piece, you received that item. It'll be in your shipment this week. Um, the remainder, if it's sitting on your wait list, I was successful ordering Fashion Fix last night. So they're coming in. Uh, but there were a couple of pieces that, uh, were not claimed as of last night. Here is one. The bracelet with the turquoise, the feather. So this is just a slide and slide your hand in like a bangle. 139, 139, 139. I did order more of these. I, I had to order myself a set. <gasps> the entire set. Uh, I do have a couple of the entire set coming in that I ordered last night. A flare for fierceness, fish hook backing, the brass. So if you remember, it was the brown cording necklace that had the brass um, hammered pieces coming down with the brown cording bracelet and the um, like opal type of stones. So I do have more coming in, but this was the one pair of earrings that I have right now. They are coming. They're on their way. Hopefully they're on their way. Once upon a twinkle, fish hook backing, lightweight. It looks like a statement like they would be heavy, these stones. They are not. Gorgeous sparkle. Perfect for prom, right? That probably will be worn once. <laughs> probably. Dainty fairy lights, pink moonstone. Your matching earrings sold 142, 142. One, four, two. And it's a little bit of a darker pink. Here's the ring that matches those brass earrings. That opal. Opal Odyssey. One, four, three standard stretch. Would look beautiful with the earrings, one, four, three, one, four, three. I do have more oil spill Z necklaces on the way. Um, so those, when the new Z collection is launched, the existing Z collection, although the oil spill on the paparazzi site is sold out again, it keeps selling out. Uh, <laughs> So once the new Z collection is released, anything for this year, they're going to put in the paparazzi vault. Um, so I do 
as every day I check. I did see some, I grabbed some. So I do have more of the Z uh, oil spill necklace on the way. So if you go to either our, our app or on the website and go to the Z collection, uh, you will see it in there. You could add to cart. There are, I think I have a, one or two uh, here in stock, but I've got more coming. So you can pre-claim those um, because like I said, they keep selling out and I have a feeling we may not see it again before the um, conference. Well, I don't think we'll say it again be yeah, before the new ones are released. Hey, Linda, how are you? All right. So those were the Z. I mean the Z. I have Z on the brain. You guys know why. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. Imperial Incandescence. Uh, Life of the Part. No, this was a exclusive piece. Standard stretch, the black with the white rhinestones, 145, 145. <gasps> Who's hanging out with me at 930 when we're going to talk about paparazzi? Yeah, we have questions ready. Trending treasure. That gorgeous green enamel, white rhinestones. That is just a really, really pretty, can be worn casually, dressy with the bling. And I've paired it with a couple of different green necklaces. That is sold 146, 146. So the first of which, is this longer so three strands at the bottom it starts off with a single chain comes down to three um, the bottom one has a lanyard which I keep forgetting to give this to mr. bling to fix because it's on the, the jump ring backwards um, but if you don't want the lanyard on there it's very easily removable we are not allowed to modify the jewelry uh, so I cannot do it for you, but I can tell you how to do it. It's a, a simple jump ring that you just open up and remove it. Um, I need to remember to put this over so he can fix that one. Beachside Babe 147, 147 in the green. 147. This is so cute. So that green with the tassel. This silver kind of sits on top, right? So you get that dimension. Malibu Mandala 148, 148. 148. This is one of those pieces so much cuter in person than it is in the photos. 148, right? 148, yeah. Dainty emerald green. Multi-chain emerald green little faceting. Financially fabulous, 149. 149 cute little earrings dainty and doing earrings ice castle couture gorgeous they're not too too big either they're the perfect size 150 150 that emerald green with some white rhinestones. One, five, zero. That was the, uh, the color of our wedding, emerald green. Emerald green. All right.
Alrighty. Before we go on to these other pieces, just to make sure that we don't run out of time, um, we're going to do the, the bling bag. So there are eight pieces up for grabs. You guys all comment one playing card. Comment one playing card. We'll do that. While you guys are commenting that, I'm just going to go back, grab any additional uh, spread the love that I, I wrote them all down earlier, the ones that I saw. So I'm going to go back, make sure what happened to my pen. And we're going to get these all added. So you guys will comment one playing card. We'll do the bling bag. And I'll have all of the spread the love ready. Wendy. Don Swenson. My handwriting is atrocious sometimes. I just like spelled your name incorrectly. <laughs> Cheryl, all right, let me go double check my other. Um, spread the loves. Spread the loves. Make sure. So I have Darlene, Wendy, Dawn, Michelle, Edna, Doreen, Cheryl. And I'm going to. Cynthia, Cynthia, Dawn, Swenson, I have you in there, Cynthia, Cheryl, Michelle, Darlene. All right, let me see on these comments here. So I see Donna, Segunda, Michelle, Sean, Michelle, Donna, Michelle. Hold on, let me refresh the screen. <laughs> All right, so for those of you um, who shared via the app, unfortunately, I don't have the, I don't see any notification. So uh, I'm asking for anybody, when you do spread the love, do it from Facebook. I'll see those notifications and it just has to be spread publicly. Publicly and we'll get you added. So publicly, publicly share, Darlene, Wendy, Dawn, Michelle, Edna, Doreen, Cheryl, and Cynthia. Am I missing anyone? Awesome, Don Tucker, thank you. So we'll add, 
<laughs> Debbie, five of hearts, got it. Um, I will add in here Don Tucker, Segunda, and there was one more that I missed up here. I saw it. I saw it. Lots of comments. Donna. Donna, Segunda. Donna. Segunda. Michelle, I got. I got Michelle. I got Edna. I got Darlene. Don Swenson then. Hi, Christine. My cat was on my phone. <laughs> All righty. So we're doing the bling bag. And let me make sure you get on. We are doing the Spread the Love giveaway. So if you have not already commented your card, then you wanna comment that. So what I'm seeing so far with cards, we have Darlene, Jack of Hearts, Christine, Seven of Hearts, Edna, Eight of Clubs, Donna, Martin, Queen of Hearts, Cheryl, a Seven of Diamonds, Tanya, Five of Clubs, Linda, Nine of Hearts, Don Tucker, Three of Clubs, Jean, Ten of Hearts, Don Swenson, Jack of Diamonds, Wendy, Three of Spades, Michelle, Six of Hearts, um, Debbie, Five of Hearts. Alrighty, here we go. Eight pieces. So you have your choice. You can put uh, credit for eight pieces on your account. Uh, you can have me select eight pieces for you. Um, and I'll go back and look at uh, items that you've claimed uh, to make sure that I, I choose stuff that I think you will like. Um, or you can mix it up. You can say I want, you know, four pieces uh, credit and four mystery. So you have some flexibility where you can choose what you want. But that's a major shopping spree. Eight credits. <laughs> that is a major shopping spree. Alrighty, here we go. Here we go, spread the love. Hello, Beverly. And she has an ace of hearts. All right, let me get back to that. And here, and we're gonna spread the love after this one. All right, our Oh, Darlene's way ahead of me. Drum roll is already in place. So credit for eight. Shipping does apply. Ten of diamonds. I think we might have a winner. We might have a winner. Ten of diamonds. Who is that? I thought. Oh, Jack of diamond. Ten of heart. Hold on, I gotta go back up to the top. So, Jack, seven, eight, queen, seven, five, nine. Jean, you were so close. Dawn, you were so close. Three, six, six, five. We do not have a winner. So, I'm just going and looking again, make sure. Um, so, this card will not go back in. That means that Friday night we will play again. There will be nine pieces up for grabs Friday night. So that is going in that card. I'm going to make a note. Friday, nine pieces. Holy cow. Nine pieces. Up for grabs on Friday. Oof. All right. We're gonna do the Spread the Love giveaway. Uh, so every Wednesday we do do the Spread the Love. Um, because I am going, I'm really trying to uh, build my business, um, 
I'm gonna start to do this, I think, after every live. So anyone starting on um, Friday, anyone who spreads the love from tonight for tonight's show, I'll put you in the drawing on Friday. Anyone who spreads the love from Friday night show, you will go into the drawing on a Sunday. So we're gonna do a spread the love drawing every single live, um, but the, it must be shared from Facebook and it must be shared publicly so I see those notifications. Um, and I will do it on every live for the previous live show. So I really am asking for all of you to help me get the word out, continue to grow my business, um, help me get to that Z necklace. <laughs> please, please. Alrighty, so tonight's Spread the Love winner is, I got one piece in here. My fingers aren't working. Uh, Darlene Harrison. Darlene Harrison, congratulations. So you will get credit for two free pieces for Spread the Love. Spread the Love. So I'll put a credit on your account. So congratulations. Thank you again. Thank you to everybody who continues to help me by spreading the love. I truly, truly appreciate it appreciate it oh you're welcome thank you all right we're going to continue in here um showing some pieces 9 30 uh i hope you guys will stick around um if you know anyone who is looking to um start a home based home based business earn a little extra money earn a lot of extra money uh it is possible with paparazzi Sparkle of the day, please invite them. 151151. One, one, one. I am uh, looking to build my team, help other people to start their own business. Uh, I feel like I really have a lot to offer um, team members. And I want to help people. 151 black faceted stones in there. 151, 151 with that necklace. A couple of different options for earrings. So both of these have uh, some hematite, right? So you're going to pull in uh, some of that gray tone. These are jacket earrings, crystal canopy sold 152 152 so this back piece will sit behind your earlobe you can actually wear them in a couple of different ways you can put both in the front this piece in the back you can wear just the teardrop shaped black so you've got flexibility versatility 152 152 152 uh, this is a fish hook backing. These two have some hematites in them. A smaller earring, east side etiquette. If you like a little dangly earring. Oh, you know, I, I have not heard back from her. I messaged her. I have not heard back. So I hope that... Um, you know things work out for her I would have loved to have <gasps> had her join under me sorry I'm like you guys know I always have issues with this <laughs> <It> stops <gasps> but you know I just hate to see um, anyone like join and then just be left on their own because if you don't have someone to help, I mean, there's a lot of information out on the paparazzi website or on YouTube, um, but if you don't have somebody to help guide you or, you know, we've tried different things. And having that experience of 
what have you tried what works like I feel like our existing team members because we did some trial and errors with different things I think that they're kind of ahead of the game because they're not having to go through and, and try different things um, you know we shared with them what definitely worked what didn't work um, so I think having that experience helps people one five four that is a stretchy bracelet suburban scene stretch i have a couple of different stretch bracelets this one looks like a bangle feels like a bangle <laughs> stretchy yours and mine so this one runs a little bit bigger right so it definitely gives more of a bangle uh feel to it one five two but it is a stretchy bracelet the silver with the black little oh i just got hooked in my ring the black little rhinestones on there i have this one in with pink stones i have it with white uh rhinestones as well so if anyone would like to see either of those colors let me know that is sold 155 and we also have this stretchy i love this one i love the detailing and then you have that black right in the center. Painted Garden 156. 156. 156. Some dainty. All right. This necklace, I have this in silver. Uh, it has black and hematite. I also have it in the gunmetal, and the gunmetal has purple, green, black, and hematite. So both of these, I'm going to just hold them both up so you can see both colors, and then I'll scan them in individually. These are, these are so pretty. Very dainty. So we'll start with the silver. So dainty, the tassel earrings. Time to be timeless, 157. So this one, the black with the hematite. Which I paired with this bracelet. So necklace is 157. 157. Whoops. The bracelet. Another, it's got some substance to it. Born to be dazzle, black with the hematite, stretchy, 158, 158, 158, the gunmetal, time to be timeless in the multi. So, like I said, the green, purple, hematite, and black, your dainty gunmetal chain. That is sold 159. 159. So pretty. And with this one, I paired this gunmetal cuff bracelet. This is cool. So, it's almost like three strands that are kind of, you can see how it kind of twists around. Um, this one has, I have plenty of room. I have an average size wrist. Bringing basics back in black. Uh, it has some give, so you can squeeze that down in gunmetal. All right, I showed this bracelet to you guys, but I wanted to show you this necklace which is perfect with the bracelet so the brown moonstone with tassels so this one's a little bit um, shorter right medium length on this one mountain mystic with that brown moonstone that's a solid one solid piece with the moonstone in there and that bracelet Gorgeous. So necklace 161, 161. Necklace 
Dreamy Destinations, Lobster Claw with the Extender, that Brown Moonstone, 162, 162, 162, with that. Some yellow gold um, bling. We have some bling with yellow gold. Dainty chain, larger stone, top dollar diva, top dollar diva. This is gorgeous. I do have this in gunmetal as well. So the gunmetal, 163, sold 163. That dainty, and this one has the little rhinestone earrings, 163. Now this one, you have the little bit of a larger Starlet Socials 164, 164. I should put that in a box so you can actually see what it looks like. Oh, we didn't even do the wood. How to do those real quick. Real quick, but let me put this necklace down on here so you can see how it sits. Um, Friday night, we are back at 9 p.m. Eastern. It's game night. Any suggestions for Friday night? Starlet Socials. 164, 164. Daintier still, right? But packs a punch with all the faceting. 164. So pretty. 164. Solid hammered texture with the rhinestones. Darlene says Blingo. Stardust gold necklace. 165. Name that tune. I wish I could do that. I'm not even sure how I could do that. Because you we really can't play music. Um because Facebook could shut you down. <laughs> Thank you. And trust me, you don't want me singing. <laughs> that will just chase everybody away. Um, I don't know if I ever told you this story when we're in the car, right? Because everybody, who, who doesn't sing to the radio, right? But when I start singing, Mr. Bling automatically turns the music up. <laughs> I think uh, I think that is an indication. I see the lyrics and we name it. Ah, that's a good idea. Vintage Royale, 166, look at this. Oh my goodness, 166. <laughs> that's a good thing, because trust me, you don't want me to, you don't want me to sing. <gasps> this is stunning. Again, another like prom season, formal season. Uh, for those of you that are going out and spending fortunes on gowns, don't spend a fortune on the jewelry to go with it. But beautiful. That is sold 166, 166. All right, let's do the wood pieces because we're down to like 918. And actually, I'm going to show you this bracelet which would be beautiful with that necklace. Yellow gold with the rhinestones. This has a lobster claw and extender. That sold 167, 167. I like the whole, I say lyrics. And we could do it like in different categories. 167, sorry, I was saying 167. This is 167 for the bracelet. All right, let's do um, the wood pieces, because I was kind of in that. So this necklace we have in different colors. So all of these behind me are the same, three strands of the wood. It's a little bit different than this one, right? So these layers are all the same. This one here gives you 
that layered look. So all of these do have that same bead and loop, loop closure. Wonderfully Walla Walla in orange, 168, 168 for the orange. The earrings, which are the ones I have on, are these wood hoops, 169, sold 169. 169. All right, so we'll go to red. So the red in that is 170. 170 for red, and they all have the brown cording. 170 in red which I paired with these longer wood. Now these look heavy, they are not heavy at all. Totally framed, 171, 171. So we're gonna jump into, at 9.30, we're gonna jump into all about paparazzi, what it's like to be a consultant. I'm gonna answer any questions that you may have. Um, so don't be afraid to ask. There is no silly question at all. At all, at all. So that is the red. The pink. So this pink is just a little bit darker than the pink that I have on. 172, 172, and we're going to stay live on both uh, Facebook and the app. So we're just going to continue right into it. 172, I was going to uh, stop and then restart, and I said, oh, what's the point? We're here. <gasps> and these brown wood earrings. So again, anything wood, acrylic, leather, uh, wait, almost wait list, wait lists. <laughs> 173, 173, I love those. And the teal. So teal, One seven four, one seven four. Not really, probably even seeing it with mine. One seven four for teal, and a larger wood teal earring. Powers of Zen. One seven five, one seventy five. Again, very very lightweight. Probably light, well, no, I have these wood that I could barely even feel these, too. Um, but probably lighter than any of the, like, silver earrings, metal earrings. Okay. So those are the wood pieces. And it's 923. I have time for a couple more. <laughs> so, all right. Maybe we'll do a couple of different games. Maybe we'll do like one blingo game and we'll do a family feud um, and a name that tune. We'll have a di couple of different options. Bull in a China Shop. This is a gorgeous statement piece. One solid piece. The earrings are super cute. Um, so it's a, a nice statement piece without being really, really chunky. 176, 176. Love that. But I paired it, so I pulled in some pink with this, and I paired it with a very chunky bracelet. So this has um, three strands, two of which are pretty chunky, and then you have your faceted beading and some textured silver beads. This has a lobster claw clasp, some antiquing on there, but that is a pretty chunky. It does sound like fun, right? We'll have a good time. 
177. So for any of you that are joining us, um, Friday night, if you're new to Orbit Jewelry, uh, Friday night's our big game night. And pulling in the pink again with the earrings. So that bracelet with these earrings, fabulous. And you can just mix it up with any other um, silver necklace. It would look great. Palm tree a tiara is 178. We always do. <gasps> we do. 178. For those of you that are joining us right now for the paparazzi opportunity, we're going to jump in there in a moment. I'm just finishing up with our uh, regular live. Um, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Make sure you say hello when you pop in. Let me know if you're new to Orbit Jewelry or new to Paparazzi. So I have a few brass pieces, statement um, necklaces. This is a, all of these are on this, almost like a screen-like chain. Bling, some like, tiger's eye, rings. 179, 179. This does have the extender and lobster claw clasp. 179, love that. I, you know, this was a necklace that I was so impressed with when I opened this. Uh, and I went back in to, to get some more because I really, I wanted one for myself. <gasps> I love this piece. I just think this is a gorgeous it's it's different oh my gosh every time I look at this the thrill seeker 180 180 180 so you have all of these tassels in that metal gorgeous 180 and the third statement in brass If you have not tried another metal, um, you need to try. Step out of that comfort. I know it is hard to believe that everything is $5. <gasps> Especially you see those pieces that are just so unique um, that I guarantee somebody is going to make comment. I'm sure you all have experienced that at one time or another. People are like, oh my gosh, I love that piece. Where did you get it? Um, ringing off the hook, 181, 181. Someday I will, I will meet the people who come with, me, with these names. <laughs> A five piece bangle set in the brass, get into gear, sold 182, 182, 182. 182 a, a cup another solid piece so there's no flexibility on this one this one runs um, I would say this it would be good for medium to smaller I've got an average size wrist uh, it slides but it's fitted um, Empress etiquette 183 183 it like fits perfectly but there's no, there's no give to that one. It is solid. And last but not least, a bangle piece in the brass. So either side you have that brass and then you've got like scalloping on the other side. Just sparkle and wave. Again, perfect <laughs> name for that piece. So creative, sparkle and wave. All right, so that completes our live sale for tonight. Um, so please, I hope you guys stick around. We're gonna jump into everything paparazzi. Um, so I'm just gonna take a moment for anyone who is just joining us and welcome you. My name is Kim DuPont, this is Orbit Jewelry. I am an independent consultant with Paparazzi Accessories. 
we are currently live on both Facebook as well as our mobile app. So if you're new to us, welcome, say hello. I would love to say hi to you. Um, and please, at any point, feel free to ask any questions. Um, I will answer you completely honestly. Uh, I'm an open book. <laughs> and if I don't know the answer, uh, I will get the answer for you. But uh, I have a pretty good knowledge base uh, of paparazzi. So please let me know if you have any questions. We'll just keep this very informal. Um, I'll kind of talk about why I decided to become a paparazzi independent consultant. Um, so I'll give you my quick lowdown of my why, because we all have why. Why do we do certain things? So my initial why, and it has since changed since I first joined. Um, so I joined January 1st of 2020. I knew months before that, that I was going to join paparazzi. A friend of mine had brought me some pieces and told me it was $5. I had never heard of paparazzi and I was shocked. I was just, I'm like, no way. I mean, you guys, for those of you that are shoppers, right? The first piece you get, you're floored. Um, so I said, okay, well, maybe it's just the pieces she brought me. So she told me who she was by, had bought it from. So I went and I watched and I bought a few pieces of my own just to, cause I needed to know. And pieces arrived. And again, I'm like, wow, that's incredible. And I started watching and I started calculating in my head. And uh, we had credit card debt because my husband had lost his job and uh, we were paying for necessities with a credit card, which is probably the worst thing that you can do. And it was adding up. Uh, so I thought, okay, well, I can make some extra money. Um, I love jewelry. I believe in this product because it's amazing and help pay off the credit card debt. So I knew I was going to become an independent consultant, but I said, I'm going to start January 1st. We're going to start the year fresh tax reasons because we're starting a business. That's what I'm going to do. Um, do I regret waiting? Yes, I should have started right when I had made the decision that I was going to do it. I, I wish I had, but uh, January 1st was my time, right? That's when uh, I had made that decision. So I can't look back and uh, regret. I just have to move forward. So I started January 1st and my why has changed. My credit card debt has been paid off. Um, it's an incredible, incredible opportunity, but it's what you make of it. You know, you, you get out of it what you uh, put into it. Um, my why has evolved. Now, yes, it's about making money, right? It's a business. We want to make money, but I've since changed, right? I want, I want to continue on. It was initially just make a little extra money, I found that I found my passion. I found that this is what I want to do uh, for the rest of my life. I want this to be my full-time uh, business. So we are on the road to doing that. Um, so my why, like I said, has kind of evolved uh, since I first started. Um, and it's, I've met so many incredible people, uh, my customers, um, my teammates, um, I cannot wait to go to convention and meet more people that I look up to and I'm dying to just run up to them. And unfortunately I can't run up and hug people, but <laughs> cause I'm kind of a hugger. That's what I would do, but I can't do it. I'm going to have to control myself, but it's just been uh, such a blessing in, in our lives. And, uh, the folks that I've met along the way have really had an impact uh, on my life. Um, my customers mean the world to me. They've been, they're what's, what make Orbit Jewelry what it is today. So for all of you that are hanging out with me right now, thank you again for being uh, so supportive and amazing. So I love you guys. All right. So I joined January 1st and <laughs> my kit arrived and I kind of shocked myself 
because I did a unboxing video. I had never been on camera before, really never liked, I don't, even now, I don't really like having my picture taken, but I never had to speak on camera. And I said, okay, no one was home. I did an unboxing and I opened my box and I videotaped it. And it's on our Facebook page. It's also on YouTube. So you can check out um, that unboxing video. And I felt like, I felt relaxed. I felt like, okay, this is where I was meant to be. Um, and I haven't looked back. So of course I was scared to death to do my official first live. And sometimes I still get nervous, but uh, it gets easier over time. So you'll love it. <laughs> oh, Dawn, you're so sweet. <laughs> you're so sweet. The bling is addictive. Yes, it is. If you're new to paparazzi, it is. But if you are a walking billboard for a paparazzi, um, you can become an independent consultant just to get the discount. So you're not required to sell it. You know, some people will just join to, in order to get the discount. So if you guys think buying it for $5 is amazing, you should feel what it's like to buy it for $2.75. Because as a consultant, that's what we buy it for. So we earn 45% commission or $2.25 on every piece that we, we sell. And it's not just live sales that you sell. I mean, you can take it if you're working in an office, you can take it uh, to work. Um, friends, I, uh, one of my teammates, she plays cards once a week and they'll switch. When the ladies come over to play cards, she's selling then when they're over. So there's a lot of different ways that you can sell it. You can do events, um, in-house parties. Now that had kind of stopped, right? Right around the time that I had joined, a lot of that in-house uh, events or parties became non-existent. Hey Trish, how are you? We are talking all about paparazzi. Um, so I kind of walked into it right at the start of COVID. So, you know, my opportunities for selling really were kind of limited. I was limited to doing uh, Facebook Lives or, um, you know, telling people about it, sharing via Messenger or taking pictures and sending it to friends and family. Um, things are starting to open up. So now I think more event, we're seeing more like flea markets and um, outside events taking place where you can go out and set up a little booth and sell um, there. Bling bags, right? Bring in your bling bag wherever we go now that we're starting to kind of venture out. Um, so there are multiple ways that you can sell paparazzi. This is probably the most, um, I don't want to say the easiest because sometimes it's not easy, right? Building up that clientele. But during the whole COVID <laughs> phase, which still is an effect, this was probably the easiest way to do it. So any questions so far that any men, anyone may have? I'm just going to go check my the comments on both Facebook and we are, like I said, we are live on our mobile app. Um, so let's talk about that for a second, right? What, uh, what, I, what we did, right? We're using Facebook. We have evolved and we have the app, right? So that kind of scares some people. Like, I, you know, I, don't, I can't do that right now. It's not where we started. So we started... Um, turning on a camera and and going live um, and with our friends and family. And like I said, because of COVID, we didn't have a lot of whole, lot of opportunities. So just because other people have certain methods does not mean that that's the method that you have to utilize. Um, we have tried different things, right? And we've evolved to where we are today. Uh, I was saying earlier on the live that 
you know, I feel like I have a lot to offer because we've tried different things. And for those that join my team, and my teammates now that are on my team, I feel like I can say, we tried it, it did not work at all, so skip over that one. Don't do that one. Because <gasps> um, I don't want to see anybody struggle at all with, you know, how do I do this? Um, and everybody has all kinds of questions at the beginning. What do I do with my... Uh, storage you know how do I do this and I think a lot of people honestly when I first started that's what I was kind of thinking about like where am I going to put the jewelry and my focus wasn't really where it should have been right so that was a lesson that I learned so being able to help people um, bypass some of those hard lessons that I learned <laughs> That's what I want to be able to do to help people. Uh, so that's just a side note. Um, so as far as becoming a, an independent consultant, when you sign up with Paparazzi Accessories, you automatically get a replicated website, right? So there's another method um, of selling. So as soon as it's you're signed up and you have your consultant ID, you automatically have a replicated website that people can go to and shop from, the, and you get the commission. So there's really kind of two different methods right off the bat. That you get your kit, you have pieces physically on hand that you can sell at immediate, get immediate commission. And then you have the replicated website that people can go to, shop from, paparazzi does the invoicing, paparazzi does the shipping, you get the commission. 45% commission. So it's fabulous. You have those two avenues for selling your jewelry, um, which is good. No other company that I am aware of does anything like that. Um, so all you have to do is share that link because you have that link to your website that Paparazzi gives you. So you go in and you kind of customize it uh, a little bit with putting your name and you're a little bit about who you are and just share that link out to friends and family um, and they can just go and shop right there and you will get that commission check for anything that is purchased directly from your web replicated website kind of cool kind of cool um, so let's talk about kits what's available so there are three different uh, kits available and right now we just received notification the conference is taking place so with the large home party kit um, a conference ticket comes with that which is huge because the conference tickets right now um, are $245 so the large home party kit you get 200 pieces of jewelry plus a conference ticket and the conference is taking place this year it was virtual last year um, so that's for, as far as value wise, that is the, the best option. That one is $499, $499 for 200 pieces of jewelry and your conference ticket. Plus you get other, um, goodies in there. Um, so a display bust, or, you know, ring, um, some receipts and like all your little extras on top of that. But most of us really are, you know, we want, we want the jewelry. Um, now that first kit that you purchase, you don't get to choose the pieces that you want. But once you've signed up, like as soon as you sign up, you can start going on to the, what we call the back office and shopping for the pieces in the back office. So that initial kit, you do not get to choose, but they put amazing pieces in there and they put a um, large variety of items because right? we all have different likes. Um, they put fashion fix pieces in there. The only thing that you won't see in the kits are any Z collection pieces, but there's some amazing options or um, pieces in there. A lot of the kits will have pieces that the consultants will never even have access to, which is kind of cool. Uh, so that's the large party kit. The small party kit um, is $299 and you get 120 pieces of jewelry in that. So that's considered the small party kit. And then there is a sampler kit. 
the sampler kit is 35 pieces of jewelry for $99. So overall, you know, depending on what you're looking to do, some people just want to join for the discount. So the $99 kit may be the op best option for uh, somebody who's just looking to, to do it that way versus the $200 um, or the 200 piece kit, you know, those are, it's the one, the best value because your pieces, the number of pieces comes to out to like 225 a piece. I think if you do the calculations, um, plus that, that, uh, ticket, which is huge. Um, so, and those go on sale, the tickets for the conference actually go on sale, um, May 18th for, uh, existing, um, consultants so you just go on like once you've joined and you have your voucher you will go on so you definitely if you're considering doing it I would highly suggest you do it um, sooner than later because uh, there will be a limited number of people that are able to attend conference so I think those tickets are going to sell out like that um, so those are the three kits that are available um, so you have your kit and the media, like, like I said, the immediately when you sign up, you have access to go in and start shopping and buying the pieces. So let's talk about requirements, right? On <laughs> being a paparazzi consultant, one, you must be 18 years old. Uh, two, there cannot be more than one consultant, uh, per household. So if you're a, a mom and daughter or two sisters, if you're living in the same household, uh, it can only be one consultant in the household. Um, you will be required to maintain consultant status. You will be required to purchase 100 pieces uh, per year. So think about that. 100 pieces per year comes out to, you know, 8.33 pieces per month. Some of you do that in one night. So that's just to maintain your consultant status, being a consultant with paparazzi accessories. That's what the minimum amount that you have to purchase is 100 pieces in a 12 rolling month period. So if you were to join today, you have up until the end of May 4th, today's May 5th, the end of May 4th to purchase. Um, and your kit count, so almost like your first year is almost included depending on what kit you choose, right? Because those go towards your, um, your yearly 100 pieces, so. If you buy the large home kit, you're you're set for a year. You can join now and not buy another piece until um, next April. I highly doubt that that would ever happen, but that could that could happen. Now, then there is so that's a consultant. Then there is an active consultant. So an active consultant, when you go to the paparazzi accessories website, um, if you have never been there, paparazziaccessories.com and you go to enter your zip code. So if you're searching for a consultant in your area and you enter a zip code, in order for you to display as a, a consultant in that area, you have to be what's called an active, empl active employee, active consultant. <laughs> and in order to be an active consultant, you must purchase 25 pieces per month. Again, very manageable. Right, especially if you get on Fashion Fix, because that's a guaranteed 25 pieces each month, and then you're available in that search when people go to paparazziaccessories.com. Um, so that is that's kind of neat, and that is the minimum requirement. There are so many different perks, um, there are different ranks, so there are ranks for your own personal sales. And so right now I am gold life of the party rank um, or life of the party on my way to platinum and then your uh, rank which is based off of your team and 
the number of people you have on your team and how they're doing and how they're ranking up. So there are multiple ways of receiving different compensation or incentives. There are trips that you can earn. Um, there is the Z necklace that you could potentially buy, which I am in uh, the competition for right now. So excited, so honored to be uh, with all of these men and women uh, in this competition because there's amazing, amazing consultants out there. Uh, any questions so far? I hope I'm kind of covering all of the pieces that you may be thinking about. Um, now, why would you choose me, right? Because choosing your sponsor is important. And I've had conversations with different consultants who are signed up under someone else. Um, you know, some positive, some negative. So one of the things that I want to be able to do and is really, really important to me and dear to my heart is making sure that I provide everything possible to help somebody um, get to where they want to be, right? So some of the conversations that I've had with other consultants is I didn't even know that there were new releases every day or uh, I didn't know I could do that or I didn't know I couldn't do that. So a lot of the information, like I said, is available where you can go and access that. But at the beginning, right, you're thinking like about so many different things. You're trying to come up with a business name and um, trying to decide how you want to sell your, your jewelry and what you want to do. Like there's so many different facets to the business that having somebody who can, you know, you can sit down and talk to. Um, and some of us retain better by either seeing it or hearing it versus reading it. Uh, and with today's technology, you do not have to be sitting or living in the same town or state, right? We have Zoom meetings. Um, I'm part of, the, of this amazing elite group. We have Monday through Thursday, we have these power hours um, where you're not required to attend them, but they're great and we keep them, we record them. So there's always those tools and the training available uh, for anybody who needs or wants it. Um, and I'm there to help you um, answer questions, help guide you, brainstorm, you know, what's working, what's not working, what are some of the things that we could do to help. Uh, I had a con consultant who was struggling at one point with uh, inventory and like right now the deliveries are uh, delayed and for those of you that shop with me you guys have heard me say that and I'm completely transparent with uh, information so I sent her some jewelry because she kind of felt like she was showing the same thing over and over again so as a consultant you get hostess rewards for um, every 10 pieces that you purchase you get a free piece which it, you know is what we use to do games or drawings for different things um, so I want to help people um, who are struggling. I want to help people who are doing great, right? Because we can all benefit from each other. Um, it's team, teamwork, truly, truly teamwork. It is not, you must do what I say you do, <laughs> other than compliance, because there are rules of things that you can and cannot do. So that I would say don't, because you can be terminated as a consultant if you're not um, ad adhering to compliance. Um, you know, example, you can't sell on marketplace or, um, um, what's the other one? Craig's left. You can't sell, you can advertise, but you can't sell. So like those things, yeah, I would tell you if I ever came across that, don't do it, don't do it. Cause you could be terminated as a consultant for those. Any, anybody have any questions whatsoever? At all I hope you found this helpful and if you do I'm gonna pop my email address in the chat here let me Kim at orbit jewelry.com dot com please
please feel free to email me. Did that go through? Yes, it did. Um, I don't know. Let me put it on. I think if I put it on the app, it's going to go to both places. Let me put it on the app as well. Jewelry. If I could type. There we go. Cool. Yeah, it went to both. So you'll see it twice in <laughs> in Facebook. <gasps> but I'll, I have to tell you, it was the best decision I ever made. I, um, I knew I loved the jewelry, but I never realized how much I was going to love what I do. I really, I, I didn't expect it to turn out the way it has. Um, and I hope it comes through and uh, I, I, lo I love every single second of this, of this. And what you put into it is what you get out of it. So I'll be completely honest. If you think you're going to buy a kit and turn the camera on and sell a thousand pieces well you were not going to have a thousand pieces when you first buy your kit but if you bought more pieces um that's not reality right S for some people it, it may happen and oh my gosh i would be jumping up and down and so excited for you if that did happen but um it takes it takes hard work it takes dedication it takes uh having a passion right you gotta love what you're doing you have to love what you're doing for it to um, not feel like work, right? This does not feel like work to me at all. I could be here probably eight hours a day and not on camera selling. Uh, and that's the other thing. I don't really consider myself a salesperson whatsoever. Uh, never did direct sales, um, never sold anything. But to me, the jewelry sells itself. Oh yeah, you're just the middleman showing the jewelry, right? Do you guys that are with me, that are on the app, um, that shop with me ever feel like I'm selling you something? Because <laughs> I don't feel that way whatsoever. Um, I'm not a salesperson. It's show and tell. That's what it is. And when you love it, and you're excited about it, your customers love it and are excited about it. I believe that. All right. Well, if anyone has any questions, I'll give it a second because there is a delay on Facebook. So I'll give it a moment. If you do have any questions whatsoever, uh, please let me know. I am more than happy to answer. If you want to hop on the phone and chit chat about it, um, you know, you don't want to ask a question on here. That's fine too. Uh, do you have the pink necklace that looks silver from the front and more pink from the side views? Um, I'm not sure if I know which one that one is, Dawn. Kind of like those earrings that I showed um, the other night that straight on they had look more silver and then as you turn them you pick up more of the color I don't believe I have that but you know what if you midsummer something okay I will let me make a note of that midsummer something I'll just something I'll find it for dawn yeah I will message you and let you let you know I'll check to see with my team if they have anything like that but, all right cool well if no one has any questions like I said if you want to um, send me an email if you want to hop on the phone talk more about it uh, I'm more than happy to do that, answer any questions that you may have. Um, oh, you're so welcome. You're so welcome. So we're still live on both, uh, both places. 
or if you're ready and you're looking to join, I would love for you to join my team. Um, and in the uh, link, the I'll put the link in here on how to, um, if you're ready to join, you wanna join me right now, you can click on the link that I'm gonna put in here right now. So give me one second. Um, and I will get that added right in here, copy and pasted, paste, there it is. So if you are ready, that is my link directly to paparazzi to sign up, but please let me know if you have any questions. I will answer whatever I can. Um, we are live. Oh, Dawn, thank you so much. You're so sweet. We are live on Friday night. It's game night. So, so far, we're kind of thinking, name that tune, Family Feud and Blingo. We always do uh, game night on Friday. So, 9 p.m. Eastern, uh, we will be live <laughs> selling some jewelry, show and tell. Remember, I'm not selling. I'm just showing. Uh, and we're playing games. So, you can win a bro some bling at the same time um message me let me know if you have any questions send me an email it is pinned right there i want to thank you all for popping in here and you all have a great thursday friday night we are back at 9 p.m eastern for those of you who shopped with me earlier tonight thank you so much and i will see you guys later on thanks bye